Hello everybody and welcome back to the kitchen. It is uh, Friday and we want to produce something that's going to be great for dinner and something that's going to be easy. We're all about that easy life. So let's have a look at what we've got. So today we're going to be doing some loaded wedges. I have got some kumara here, which is our sort of um, sweet potato here in New Zealand. And I've got another sweet potato. This one's orange and some um, baking potatoes. I've got salt and pepper, oil, garlic, paprika, and I think that'll do to make some really good so wedges. I've chopped so up go. all my um, potatoes and things so that they're mostly an even size. We don't want small ones that are going to go soggy and bigger ones that are going to be not quite cooked. We want them to all cook evenly. So the good thing about having like kumara and these sort of kumara is it adds variety with the colour and the flavour as well. Now I've chucked in my garlic and my uh, paprika and salt and pepper with a little bit of oil. I'm going to give them a toss around and pop them onto a lined roasting dish. So look how good they let's look. Let's do that. Yum. I'm excited already. So you need to be able to spread them out so that they're going to be able to cook and the ear can get around all of them or thereabouts. You know, you don't want them piled on top of each other. Now, the other thing that you could do is, is put in things like um, roast cauliflower or... Um, uh, other things that you can roast. I can't even think about them. Roast pumpkin. Um, yeah, just so that you can have like a variety of wedges. It'll be just absolutely beautiful. So let's chuck this into the oven, which I've heated at 185 degrees. You knew that, didn't you? And let's roast them off for about half an hour and see how we go. Right, hey, have a look at those. How good do they look? Now, don't be tempted to think, oh, it's all over there done. What we're going to do is we're going to give them a rough toss and then we're going to put them into the oven for another 10 minutes because that's going to like crisp them up a little bit more so and don't forget that these ones smell beautiful if they smell good they'll taste good that's my Those theory gorgeous gorgeous wedges look absolutely amazing smell fab and i am going to dress them up now you can put anything you want on this if you just want to smother it in tomato sauce you do you i'm going to put some um sour cream and avo and other bits and pieces on it to make it look good and taste good Right, there we go. So good. I've got bacon and cheese and uh, avo and sour cream and I am looking forward to our dinner. Yep. Look at that. Yum. Mm, yum, delicious. Flipping beautiful. So... Hope you guys are well. Take it easy. Thanks for following us. We really appreciate it. And we shall see you very soon. Kaki tiano.